Well, Christmas just over a week away and shoppers are piling into stores hunting for those deals. Yes, Lauren Winfrey is live in the midst of the madness, though it seems pretty calm around you right now at Mayfair Mall. Yeah, it's not so bad up here, Shannon, but when you need something and you need it now, forget shopping online. Here is the place to be, and that's why so many people were at the mall today shopping for those last-minute gifts. Tis the season <laughs> for frantic shoppers. I really have a good excuse. I just kept putting it off and putting it off. Large bags filled with gifts. Looking for uh, last minute presents for our granddaughter. And malls brimming with business. Lines were long, but they speeded us through. With just 10 days until Christmas, the foot traffic at Mayfair Mall is steadily flowing. But shoppers say it isn't crunch time just yet. This is not last minute Christmas shopping. We got a whole week to go. Some people argue they still have one or two names on their list and the race to beat the clock is on. I haven't shopped for my husband. He hasn't given me any clues. But whether you're shopping for one or a couple of little ones, a survey by Prosper Insights and Analytics says the average consumer plans to spend about $1,000 on gifts this holiday shopping season, and Santa says it's best to do it with a smile. That's my favorite part. Everybody smiles. And mall officials tell me on any given Friday, about 40,000 shoppers walk through these mall doors. But on the second to last Friday before Christmas, they expect those numbers to be a lot higher. Reporting live at Mayfair Mall, Lauren Winfrey, today's TMJ4. Ah, there's plenty of time. Don't worry about things. Thanks, Lauren.